Hello guys, in this video I want to prove the following problem. I want to show that there exist two irrational numbers, a and b, such that a to the power b is going to be rational. And one of my examples that I'm going to use, let's take a to b equals square root of 2 and b equals square root of 2. And you know that square root of 2 are in both cases are irrational numbers. Irrational. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to consider uh, a to the power of b and where a to the power of b is square root of 2 to the power of square root of 2. And for this, uh, for a to the power of b, I have two cases. The first one is going to be either rational or this expression is going to be irrational. Okay, so if this expression is rational, then we are done. Why? Because we found two rational numbers such that uh, a to the power of b is going to be rational. So in the case, if you're going to go this direction, it's going to be rational. So we are done. Check. But what if this number is going to be irrational? So if number is irrational, we're going to create a new pair of a and b. So let's make the new a to b equal square root of 2 to the power of square root of 2. And you know by this assumption that this a is irrational. And what we're going to take as b? We're going to take just b as previous one. We're going to take square root of 2. And this is also irrational. And let's compute... Uh, what is our a to the power of b? And what I will get? I will get that my a is square root of 2 to the power of square root of 2 and to the power of square root of 2. And this is equals to uh, square root of 2. Uh, by power law, I have square root of 2 times square root of 2 in my power. Uh, then I will get this is equals to square root of 2 uh, square root of 2 times square root of 2 is going to be square. So square root of 2 is square is just equal to 2. So what I get? I get that a to the power of b is equal to 2. So a to the power of b is rational. Yeah, and we are done. Thank you for watching.